Rush Hour Fit, back at it again. It's your boy Max P. It's your boy. The P stand for gains. <laughs> Quit cutting me off, bro. You don't forgot. I go first. Your turn. <laughs> and it's your boy Drew Blue or Julius. And we back up in this thing. And man. uh, yeah, we trying to get our fitness channel uh, up and running again. You know, the main reason we're doing it is for accountability, and plus to flex on folks to you know to show that to everyday people. You know, uh, just to get a little background about things me and Julius have in common. We're both married. Both have ch- uh, one kid. He has a son. I have a daughter. And, you know, we we work, too. We got to balance life and we got to balance work. Uh, but we still got to also take care of our health. So that's one of the reasons why we stay in touch with each other. I just recently moved to Arizona to start work. So we're not going to be together. Julius cried a little bit on my departure. Uh, and, of course, the way we left at it was, you know, we had to have a good meal. We ate some five guys cheeseburgers and french fries absolutely healthy healthy for the for the colon but uh anyways i'm gonna let judas look give you a, a little introduction of where he's been and then uh we'll start from there all right so basically uh ditto everything max said uh when he left i did not cry i actually was happy he was leaving because he going somewhere he better than himself uh me i work in education you know i'm always uh around folks who want to eat so that's my issue man just eating right i'm in the gym every morning 5 30 in the morning every day but the, the eating, main line <laughs> you said julius would send me a text yeah. be like hey man i couldn't roll out of bed i missed the gym <laughs> this week okay look that was this week i went this morning i still got my straps on but yeah i went uh i'm usually in the gym every morning it's just the eating right so my goals yeah. are to uh my goal is to drop down to 200. I'm two. I don't even want to say it, but I'm 259 right now as we speak. Mm, damn, um, dick. My bench is my bench is uh my max is 405. I got that one time when thanks to Max spotting me. Yeah, uh, I can't spot though. <laughs> I need to look. I need to do that. Yeah. I'm in a uh, I'm in the 400 club on almost every major lift lift, but uh. I'm just trying to cut this weight, and I yeah. know my strength gonna go down. But that's pretty yeah. much it. Yeah, and I'm in the same boat. I'm about um, I started at about 215. I'm gotten down to 204. But my goal, my goal weight, uh, reasonably speaking, is I want to get around to about 185 by April or so, April or May. Um, and from there, I may take it down to 175 if I decide. So I haven't been 175 since I was married, and that was like four years ago, four or five years ago. I don't know my anniversary. I'm sorry, Tiffany. Um, but either way. Um, you know, I, I, I was in school, I was getting my master's, uh, you know, trying to do some of my life. And uh, that's what took a hiatus from the channel so much to focus on, you know, trying to finish and finish school. But now that I'm finished, back at it again. Um, let's go ahead and to the next topic. Let's talk about our meals. So we talked about dieting. So how are we, how are we, how are we on that, Julius? What you been eating? Man, look, so <clears throat> since what? Getting of the year, what is what's today? It's the 16th. Shout out to my Zetas, happy Founders Day. But um, it's the 16th, and I've been eating right, so I done dropped maybe six pounds since the beginning of the year. Uh, I started at like 264 or something, and I'm like 264, 265, and I'm 259 right now as we speak. So uh, I've been pretty much eating healthy. Uh, my wife, she's doing vegan for this for this month. She's trying to see if it's sustainable. And so I've been pretty much eating whatever she's been eating. So not too much meat. I bought some um, tofu today. I'm going to try it out. For real, I bought some tofu. It, like, um, And I'm out here in Arizona. Ah, I'm tripping. I'm talking like I'm from Tennessee. I'm out here in Arizona, and they got a lot of different um, foods for their demographics. People are here are more health conscious and organic. No offense to Tennessee, but I think I like they're out here like they really look at the labels and things like that. They got extra firm tofu. Mm-hmm. In the produce aisle, like I, I don't see that in Tennessee. So I went ahead and bought some. It was, it was like three dollars. Hey, I'm gonna. I'm, I just came. I'm gonna try it, man. I, I, I mean, I'm I just a, came back from Kroger. They had some and, too. Uh, it wasn't nothing but. No, nah, they ain't had no tofu. They had slab of ribs <laughs> on uh, <laughs> sale. Now that's one thing on in sale. Arizona. It's one thing in Arizona. Um, uh, what's it? Protein or your meats? Aside from chicken, but beef in there was t- a little bit more expensive. Like I was, I looked at a couple of steaks and they're like seven dollars for just like a. Like a good eight ounce, and I was like seven dollars, and it wasn't even a good cut too. It's just like sirloin. But um, oh, aside yeah. from that, um, you know, like I said, our biggest problem is eating, and you know, we're not 
we're not trying to starve ourselves. Starving stuff's never to go. So we do have cheat meals that we want to reach. So um, what's your next cheat meal, Julius? What, what are you looking forward to when you drop five pounds? So when I drop five pounds, man, I ain't gonna lie, I want some Oreos. <laughs> be straight real. I got some right here. I, I mean, <laughs> look, like I'm talking about, I'm gonna get a big old, I'm gonna get the whole pack of Oreos. I'm gonna get two packs. I'm gonna get the vanilla Oreos. And then I'm gonna get the uh, regular Oreos. I'm gonna get a nice. Milk. And then you put them together. And I'm gonna dip the heck out of it. There's a. Uh, I'm dip the heck out there of are some tasty videos. Mm-hmm. Uh, tasty is this, uh, this like a Facebook page or something that they post uh, easy recipes. And yeah. they'll make like cakes out of Oreos, like easy non freeze cakes or whatever. And they just, I don't know, it's, it's, it's terrible. I, in order for me to get past my cravings, I know this sounds crazy, but I watch recipe videos and just watch them. And I know I'm not the only one because there'll be like 43 million views on how to make a chicken sandwich. And I'm be like, that's a good chicken sandwich. But, um, hey, that's how it is, man. Simplicity. Yeah, my next cheat meal. See, I haven't had a cheat meal, even though I kind of, I've already earned one. I'm, I'm looking for some, some hot wings, like, because I'm missing home. Memphis I got, got some hot wings. They got a wing stop up the street, so I'm going to see if they make it the same way they do it in Memphis. Uh, maybe maybe uh, Rick Ross would roll out of there and be like, try me, try a piece. But, um, yeah. So, uh, I mean, we're, we we just wanted to give y'all an intro where we've been. Uh, like you said, you know, Julius, he's an educator. I'm in the technology industry. And, you know, we life happens, but, you know, we always set an hour, rush, hour, fit. You know, yes, it's a it's a play on the movie because I look like Chris Tucker and uh, Julius looks like Jackie Chan because, you know, he does look like Jackie Chan a little bit. You can, like see, you can see it. It's, all, it's in the, the mustache. But, um. We fit in at least an hour, hour and an hour and a half in our workouts. And honestly, I mean, Julius talked about it. Hitting your, your workouts in the morning gives you that freedom to whereas you can fit it in and the rest of the day it won't conflict with your schedule to get fit in that gym. And and plus, uh, you don't really have to worry about New Year's resolutioners uh, this time of year in the gym because at 5.30 in the morning, they they still in bed. Dude, I might change my rant. Remember when we was uh, oh. working out? What year was that? Maybe 15? Okay, all right. Let, let, all right. And, so one uh, thing we're going to try to do, February, so this, this is how we're going to keep in touch because, you know, I don't care what the distance Julius is like my brother. Uh, we are going to keep in touch. So, But we're but we're all going to try to finish our videos off with what we call a random rant uh, of the day or the week or however, however often we do these videos. So what's your rant, Julius? Go ahead and talk about it. So my rant is when I'm in the gym, I got my headphones on, I'm clearly in the gym, <laughs> and then a dude come up to me. You Why are you so close? You get, you're too I'm close, man. Get, get back. And, uh, Chicken and rice. And he he want to give you advice about something. He want to give you advice. Now, here's my thing. I'm a pretty big guy. I lift heavy weight in the gym, and it's this old man. He real scrawny, and he always coming up to me, want to give me advice. And you know I'm polite, so I don't do I don't disrespect him and be like, hey, I don't want to hear it. But it's like almost it's it's a daily thing now. And uh, I don't be wanting to hear his advice. Like it's with everything. If I'm lifting three, like today I was doing three twenty five. <laughs> he was in there. Man, that's too much weight, man. You are gonna hurt yourself. You might want to just drop. Me. I'm like, dude, look, I got this. I don't like. I, I just can't stand it. It makes me. And so what I was what I'm saying I'm gonna do. Is I'm gonna start going to him, giving him random advice. That's what I'm gonna do. <laughs> and it, it ain't gonna be gym related. It's gonna be like about finances or something. I'm gonna walk up, hey man, you need to. <laughs> yeah, man, it's a buy season. It's a bull, it's a bull market, market right now. But whatever. <laughs> my random rant. What's my random rant? Uh, what have I seen in the gym lately? Um, oh, my thing. What I saw today. This is this morning. I hit chest today. I don't understand the need for why people. People have either have they, they they either have one or two things or both. They either have too much money or too much time. I don't have either. You know what I mean? Um, I'm just saying, like, I don't have either to waste. Is what I'm saying. Stop lying. People will spend so much money on gym apparel. Like, and don't get me wrong, they got on the spandex, mm-hmm. and these are dudes I'm talking about. They got on the spandex, the shorts to go over, some nice nice shoes. They got on the Under Armour. You know, just they they ready. They ready for whatever happens to them. They, you know, they can hit a sprint you know, mid workout, whatever. But they're not lifting anything. They're just they're literally in the gym to strut and then they stick their chest out just like this. They walk around like this. And I'm in my mind I'm like in my mind I was just like you have either too much money to waste on all this gym apparel 
And you got to choose that because the people that are focused that I see, they come in there in just regular clothes. You know, they come in there maybe sweatpants, you know, whatever, a hoodie, say to themselves, and they're focused on their goals. They're not trying to talk to nobody, this and that. So my rant is, you know, to me, it's just it's a free country. Do what you will. But I'm going to I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to rant about it. So be prepared. But either way. Either way. Hey. Yeah. You know, we, we appreciate y'all taking the time to listen to us and everything. So be on the lookout for us on at least a weekly basis. At least we're gonna try to get you on a weekly yeah. basis. Uh you're gonna we our yeah, that's what, get, yeah, I mean it's 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 not it's not gonna be like, oh, we, you know, and uh, these rants come just from life. You walk in the gym and something's gonna happen and you're gonna be like, I know this person did not just walk up to me within my three feet of personal space. To ask to borrow my deodorant. Whatever. But on that note, man, what? Rush Hour Fit, back at it again. <laughs> we out. Rush Hour Fit, you know, going strong. If you want to, like, comment, subscribe. Do whatever you want to do. Say after every video. <laughs> like, like, comment, subscribe. Yeah. Oh, and, and, and uh, I got our picture up from our banner. Instagram. Man, we look so young. I got, I got anyway. a baby face and everything. You still look the same, though. Bye.